What's up everybody, I'm Rossi and welcome to another V Rising video. In this video I'm going to show you all the shape-shifting vampire powers in V Rising and how to get them. There are a total of 6 different forms you can turn into. These are wolf, bear, rat, human, toad and bat. Taking any damage, even damage from the sun or from carrying silver coins will break the form, except in bat form, but more about that later. The first and the most important form you can get is the wolf form. In this form your movement speed is increased by 24% and low level wolves don't attack you anymore. This form you can get by drinking the blood of the alpha wolf. Alpha wolf is level 16 and you can find it around the wolf den over here. Getting this form should be your number one focus at the start of the game. Then we have rat form. This form turns you into a small rat, making it harder for enemies to detect you so you can sneak past them. It comes from the level 13 putrid rat that you can craft yourself with the vermin nest with twilight snapper, 4 fish bones and 8 grave dust. Twilight snapper you can get from fishing, fish bones you get by placing fish in the devourer and grave dust you get from bones via the grinder. Rat form is useful if you just want to get past some guards without having to fight the whole village. Next form is the bear form. In this form you are able to destroy massive resources that otherwise would require explosives. It also increases your resistances by 25, movement speed by 15%, reduces the damage you take by 25%, and you regenerate health slightly faster. Being in this form also makes bears be neutral against you. This form you can get from the ferocious bear in the bear cave which is located here. Then we have the human form. This form turns you into a human and allows you to walk unnoticed in human settlements and interact with traders. However, strong-willed humans like priests will still detect you. This form greatly increases your blood consumption rate, so you cannot stay in this form for long. You can get this form from level 38 Petrice the Tailor in the Downbreak village which is located here. The next form we have is a pretty odd one. It's the Toad form. This form allows you to jump high in the air, but I'm not exactly sure what the purpose of that is. I guess you can jump over smaller fences, meaning that you could infiltrate other players' fenced areas, but other than that, I don't really see the point. It looks cool though. You can get it from the level 62 Duke of Palaton in the Cursed Forest, which is located here. And the last form is Bat Form. It allows you to fly over the map, even over the impassable terrain. It cannot be used while carrying resources or while being indoors and it requires a valid landing location when you exit the form. While flying around be aware of the day and night cycle so that you don't get burned by the sun. This form you can get from the level 76 Night Marshal Stux the Sunderer in the Cursed Forest which is located here. And that was all the vampire power shapeshifting forms you can get in V Rising. Make sure to leave a like and subscribe for more V Rising content. If you have any questions about the forms, leave a comment down below. Thank you for watching, have a great rest of your day and I'll see you in the next video.